Okay, so this is Leonard, and Leonard seems calm, doesn't he? He's not. Leonard has the unfortunate tendency of suddenly tripping out. He's very good and very sweet, and then poof, just like Swagger's, he's going crazy, just going crazy. So, well, that's okay. I'm gonna work with him, help him to chill out. It's also very good to know, of course, before you start freehandling any animal, to know what their disposition is like and that they're not going to kill you. But with that said, he's new. He ate. That was the most wonderful thing. He ate his pinky mouse. It's never a great thing to ship it out of him, you know, especially when it's hot out and everything. But thank God it was temperate. We waited for the right weather and say hi. Things worked out very nicely. But uh, I've been working with him and noticing he has these little spurts of spontaneity where he just sort of launches in every direction. Not that he's going for me. He's just getting out. You know, he's just sort of weaving. He's like, I don't like it here. He's getting out. But that's okay. I've seen this before. And I know what to do. I'll go one step at a time. Look how pretty his patterns are. Oh, he's just hanging off. But looking forward to the process, getting to know him better, you know. He is a Guarico rattlesnake. They're only from Venezuela. Just like um, just like Wadnot was. But he was a Vigrandis. He's a Pifnorum. Cortalus Pifnorum so that Talents they run this. And whatnot was called an Otaquan rattlesnake. That was his naked model. But this guy's a baby too. And you know, they're very, very different, just as they should be. So I think it's gonna be fun. I also think he's gonna be on the hook for a long time. face and head, they're all chocolatey. I was going to name him Snickers, but I realized you know, his name was Leonard, so I just had to 